23 days. That's how long one Barberville woman was kept medically sedated after her respiratory system was completely shut down by taking a quarter of a pill she thought was Xanax. Now she's sharing her story with WYMT's Haley Minogue in hopes of stopping others from making the same mistake. On December 11th, 47-year-old Jenny McCon was having a stressful day at work. We did a quarter piece by the time I got back inside I don't don't remember her friend had given her what both women believed to be a Xanax a pill the friend says she got online around 30 minutes later Jenny says her respiratory system completely shut down and I had crashed five times on the table at Barberville before they could get me stable enough to fly out she was transported to the University of Kentucky Hospital where she was kept sedated until January 3rd I was scared to death I was frightened that something really bad was going to happen to her. While she was out, doctors revealed to her family the pill had actually been ketamine, a powerful sedative used as an anesthetic in both humans and animals. I was mad. I cried. My daddy was sitting beside of me. I couldn't look him in the eye because I knew I, it was my fault. Nobody twisted my arm. Nobody made me do it. It was my own fault. Now, as Jenny continues to recover, and the ketamine done so much damage to her trachea that there ain't no way anytime soon that she's going to get that trach out. She wants to use her story to warn others of the potentially deadly dangers associated with drugs. I wish everybody could take a good look at me and just see what, if you don't know what it is, leave it alone. Don't touch it. I mean, it's not worth it. In Knox County, Haley Minogue, WYMT Mountain News. Like many prescription drugs that are abused, ketamine has many practical and life-saving uses. Anesthesia in children, a sedative in physically painful emergency procedures, and even emergency surgery in war zones are some of the medical uses for the drug.